So which is it? Talking with Roberts might be good fun for Ursula von der Leyen. But regulating their intelligence has become no laughing matter. The president of the European Commission visiting the Center for Artificial Intelligence of the Flemish University in Brussels. Here, around 200 people work on projects partly financed by the EU. Her visit comes ahead of the long-awaited presentation of the EU's strategy on artificial intelligence. Here I could see uh, how AI is serving the people. Um, and you see applications that help people in their daily life. And uh, it was fascinating to see that. In general, technology is neutral. Um, and it depends on us what we make out of it. From healthcare to transport, artificial intelligence is now crucial for innovation, but also presents risks for individual privacy. The EU wants to be the first place in the world to regulate this sector to make sure that ethics, transparency, safety and liability are respected. New rules will have consequences for big tech companies. So perhaps no surprise Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg came here to Brussels to meet top EU officials just ahead of the announcement. EU plans like privacy regulation had an impact far outside Europe's border. Any new laws on artificial intelligence could have similar effects. Elena Cavallone, Euronews, Brussels.